Well, raising chickens in your own backyard for fresh eggs is growing in popularity. And advocates say it's easier than you might think. Joining us this morning is Maxi Asagi from Asagi Hatchery in Kalihi. And she's here this morning to talk about raising your own little chicks like this and this weekend's farm fair at Kualua Ranch. Good morning, Good Rexy. Morning. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. And thanks for bringing these cute chicks in. They're so sweet. Of course, they grow into chickens eventually one yeah. of these days. Yeah. And uh, I noticed that more and more people are asking about growing their own food in their backyard for sustainability reasons, yes. right? Yes. Lots of people want to raise their own chickens. They come to us interested in getting chickens for eggs. They also eat the bugs in your yard, um, eat a lot of vegetable scraps, and um, you can compost the manure. Fertilizer. And I've tasted fresh local eggs before, and I mean, it, there's really a difference between the fresh eggs here and the mainland eggs. Uh, I know that one of the questions that people ask you all the time is, how difficult is it, and does it get kind of stinky in the backyard if you're raising your own chickens? You know, not at all. I, I think chickens are the most low-maintenance pet. They're, they take care of themselves. They're very social. Uh, all you do is you make sure that they have lots of space to run around in, mm -hmm. bugs to eat, feed. And they're pretty happy. They start laying an <laughs> egg a day at five months Whoa. of age. So you can get one egg a day, and that's de depending on how many chickens you have, then yeah. you can have a nice little breakfast there. Oh, yes. Yeah. And uh, another thing, too, is it definitely have only the hens, right? Because the roosters get kind of noisy. Yes, right? people always request the hens. So. And so you're going to be at the farm fair, and so uh, folks can get to see these little chicks up close and some of the other animals there? Yes, we're going to be at the farm fair at Kualoa Ranch this weekend. We're going to have a chick corral oh. set up. Oh. Um, kids can come by and take a look at the pigs and the cows. And I think there's going to be a, a bunch of different animals there, but the chicks are going to be in a corral there. We'll mm -hmm. have a lot of them in there. It's a fun. All right. And what's the what's the size of a ha of a hen house that you need to have if you're going to try to do one of these things? You know, I always read that I always heard that it was four square feet per bird that mm -hmm. you would need, and that's just you're also giving them a run to outside run to run around it. Well, definitely, I would love to have a yard and have some little chickens running. <laughs> yeah. Well, Maxie, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. And thanks for bringing the cute chicks in. They're oh, so yeah. sweet. They're going to fly away one of these days. <laughs> All right. To see this interview again, you can head to the top video section of our website, KITV.com.